Right, here we go! Episode... Where is it? 71? Anyway, the Carbo Cup set. Uh, Carbo Cup semi-final second leg. Could beat their 2-1 by Tottenham and that's absolute pitch to be honest, but... Carbo Cup's a daddy cup, just like Arsenal in real life. Did I want them to beat City in the final? No, obviously I didn't. But we beat Wolves there 2-1 at Ibrox in the FA Cup. Here we go into some transfer negotiations. Who's it for? Justin Clivert. I mean, imagine we offer him, what, 31? I mean, Watford offer him 31? I mean, that's a pretty decent amount for Watford, like, but he's worth more than a, he's a worth a lot more, a lot worth a lot more than that. And as you can see, transfer deadline day, pretty, not much happening. Gretzka going to Real Madrid is the most expensive. Got this game, don't want to get to Crystal Palace. And hopefully we can win. As this is the league, 3-1. No bad. Here we go though, into the next game that we're playing today. It is at St James's Park. I'm battered by the way. Alright, fair it. Back post. Lingard have signed and I mean that's a pretty PG. That is a that's a very PG tap of the ball. Martinez oh, Jesus. Could have been it, could have been one nil. Oh by the botch, Martinez again, Martinez. Finds Ronaldo, who finds Clivert, who finds Gary. Pfft, Gareth Bailey's on fire, like he synced bloody hearts literally last episode. And then, you know, to be honest, he was pretty non existent against Spurs, but at least he's bounced back here. So, what, three goals and an assist in four games? No bad, like, I mean, it could be a lot better, but no bad. Uh, Martinez through to Clivert, finesse. Pfft, oh, you should be doing better there, like, well, uh, Alright, Clive, mate. Yeah, you've been linked in the news, as you can see, linked in the news. Shao Martinez linked to a move to Bloody United. False date. Oh, that could have been it, but luckily Ronaldo has held on to it. Lingard into Hanley. What's up? No, no, clear up. Yes, sir, we go. That's what I'm talking about. Up to Morales. He plays it down to Bale. Alright, come on, Bale. Finds Martinez. He finds Morales. He loses it pretty. Unconvincingly, man, it wasn't really exactly the greatest thing you'll ever see in your life. But Gary Bale charging forward, he goes past Fapra, he's but can't tell, he's pretty quick. But get Bale, I mean, penalties would be given for that in real life, but obviously, FIFA doesn't really work in real life. Bale through Morales, right? Come on, surely this is it. Come on, make it 2 0, end the game up to Ronaldo, he won't miss from here. And that is his 13th of the season in the BPL. And I'm pretty sure I didn't score in any other competition, which is pretty weird like because usually that's not really what tends to happen but no nah, bottom right hand corner top oh top bends bottom bends mine right out to Gareth Bale Gareth Bale oh, I just lose it again very sloppy in possession we've been but still been the far better team Bale oh, that's a great play oh my god Bale oh could have been 3-0 but it's always going to be hard to score from the keeper from there Ball gets cleared, right, Johnny Evans, what can he do? He whips out to Tavernier, he whips out to Gutierrez, he whips out to Cardoso, Tavernier. Well, it's back to Cardoso. De Bale. Gutierrez. Come on. Martinez. Morales. Oh, what a save. Tim Krull, and he catches it. And, right, here we go, last chance. Martinez, through to Morales, he takes it past Sabali. Shoots. I could have been three 0 If you're waiting on over two and a half goals, like over two and a half goals, you'd be raging. But thankfully, it's no. As you can see, here are the the stats. It's it's an even enough game, like. But the clips I show, I tanked them, which I did, because they didn't really have any goal scoring opportunities, apart from. I mean, they hit the post, hit the bar, and then they hit that hang where the keeper had to tip it over. But apart from that, not much happened. Three, two, one. An FCCB and the name McKenzie. He's only 20, he's 72, so maybe he's underrated in my eyes. Right, here we go against Man City in the FA Cup. Surely we can get through the next round. We're playing a weekend team. No, they won't because they're playing Mbappe and Jesus up front, and that's nothing near, nothing near a weekend team. And Jesus gets a hat trick while Martinez actually opened the scoring. Wait, I mean, who takes off Ronaldo and brings on Rosa? Fish. Here we go, though, in the Premier League against Sheffield Wednesday. Jao opens the scoring for Sheffield. Oh, but Cliver gets a goal back for us. Who's going to win, though? Sheffield Wednesday. That is absolutely dog pish. 
Um, and there is the league table just to round off the episode. So where are we? I can't see it. Alright, we're sixth. And we're what? Six points off of Man United. Pretty surprising that Watford... Watford are actually tops. They've sank right down. But West Ham up there in third. Hopefully they play a game more than the majority of teams. But yeah, until then, pooch.